he starts DJ LeMahieu with a fastball in the shortened COVID year when he started 12 in the 60 game season. Obishet, look at that. Misses down and away. They appeal, but he didn't go. Boy, Kevin Gosman did last night. Terrific outing by Gosman. And for that one, the right field is. Right field, Judge is in and swing. Torres LeMahieu on the right side, and Ben Orbit is catching for the 13th at bat against Garrett Cole. And the Blue Jays actually, there have been times when they've hit three previous starts for Cole against the Blue Jays. Bounces in a curveball, it's two and two that he wants, he's got it. And Guerrero, another high fast as the second baseman. Right there again on the corner as he rings up. Hitting just 227 on the season. Was up for the first few days. Good changeup. Well, he's got it working tonight so far. Had a big hit in the Maria's start last time in New York. One, two. And he got him. Got a fastball by him. And again, right on the outside corner. Be that way again this week. We need that loud. Those are and a high in the air to that deep, and Judge has a very strong hits him. Curveball grounded to second. This will get belt to third, but Kerr out to second. Biggio again. Gosman among them as Whit Merrifield swings at the first pitch, and that almost. Here Myers sends one to center field. Florial with never resting on his laurels or complacent. George Spratt fairly well hit, but caught three. But Seeger and Akun Swan is gone. First pitch fastball. Yankee bullpen, and it is two to nothing. 31st and 32nd RBI. Let's go. Let's go. Judges playing. Won the count. Bouncer to short, big hop for Bichette. Lots of time to make tools again. Houston is at Seattle. Both of those games, he flares one into right for a big. And a changed up territory. Chapman has rooks the cat. Blue Jays hoping to get invited to the party. Hits one well, deep right center. And Guerrero with a drive. Just this one now coming in in left. So two down, and here's Brandon Bell. Angels again, Houston is at Seattle. Both of those games, he flares one into right for a big. And a changed up territory. Chapman has rooks the cat. Blue Jays hoping to get invited to the party. Hits one well, deep right center. And Guerrero with a drive. Just this one now coming in in left center. So two down, and here's Brandon Bell. In relief in the big leagues. He has thrown 200 or more innings. The magic number for the Orioles, by the way, to clinch the division is two. They Swing and a miss, and that is strikeout number seven for Barrios. And a base hit into right field. So they don't expect off. Runners going. And it's fouled off play and get judged to the plate in this inning. Hey, he hit a home run last time. Yeah, I know. Right over the heart of the plate. He's hit. One run is getting the wave. The throw. Runs will score. Base hit by John Carlos Stanton. And that makes it 4 nothing Yank. And a breaking ball at the knees for strike three call. But Florial is back and has room again. And this one popped up till coming in. And called strike, says Bruce Dreckman. It's 0 2. That hitters have had against the change. But not this time. Crushes another one. This one eight, and it is now 6 to nothing. to keep the inning going for the Yankees. Judge with two home runs get to the next pitch when he shakes one off do that quickly. 
Yeah, we mentioned. Vladimir Guerrero left. Volpe, the shortstop, is back. Time. In about eight, nine days where they have been two Yankee pitchers as Bell now has. Ball and two strikes on Biggio. And on the infield again. So this doesn't have anything to do with this game, but a really cool the steps would not let Francona go down the steps so that manager for the Guardians. Rip to right field, a scorcher. Now Anthony Volpe, the batter, a ball and a strike on the game. Now they've split the first two. And then the bounced in and a block by Kirk there to keep long hold. And now the 2 2 is pulled foul. And we will have it for you beginning with Blue Jays Central at 2 2 and short hop to third by Chapman. Biggio for war a battle. And it looks like Yannon pitch. Sure. And that. Everybody's over but belt. Yep. Kirk didn't. Off the corner, three and two. Going to the postseason, but finishing strong. They're 18 and nine in their lap. You know, at least we had a good September. Night for Florio out in center. But I think that gives you a yep. good indication of how the Blue Jays players feel about what's going on. Just up and away. I think it's a strike. Roller to short. Volpe. Four. So I would think if Aaron Boone asked him, do you. Popped up by Merrifield. Lots of room in foul territory to make the piece. Yeah, Jack. And it gets Barraza to chase the slider quickly out of. Popped up and near the Yankee dugout, but it's out of play. Two again. Bringer is tracking it, and he's just two hits again over eight innings. They only struck. That one misses outside. One ball, one strike. Uh, in part influenced by. The other teams who are in the race as Guerrero of Texas and Seattle, depending on how things sort out, really all they can focus on is trying to win a game. Happens tonight between Houston and Seattle, but one of those two teams is up the middle. One of those two teams is going to pick up a game on them tonight. Outside, ball two. And a four pitch walk. More of a matchup thing with Cole's high fastball. Do you throw Davis Schneider in there? He hasn't played. It would be a natural move. Grounded to short. Bichette to Biggio. 